Hi, in this video, I will teach you how to subtract two numbers by drawing lines or dots. Let us understand this by an example. Okay, in this case, you can see first you have 10 and below it there is 6. In front of 6, there is a minus sign. This way of subtraction is called as vertical subtraction. In this example, you need to subtract 6 from 10. Okay, before I start, let us learn few subtraction terms. You do not need to memorize them now, but it's good to know them. In subtraction, first number is called as minuend and the second number is called as subtrahend. The result of the subtraction is called as difference. So, in subtraction, remember that minuend is always a bigger number than subtrahend. We can say that minuend minus subtrahend is equal to difference. Okay, now we will solve this question. You know that we need to subtract 6 from 10. So, I will draw 10 lines because 10 is the first number or 10 is minuend. Here we go. We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 and 10 lines. Now, we need to subtract 6 from 10. So, I need to remove 6 lines from these 10 lines. For better understanding, I will cut 6 lines. Ok? So, I cut 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 6 lines from these 10 lines. After that, count only remaining lines or standing lines. We have 1, 2, 3 and 4 such lines. So, result of 10 minus 6 is 4. 4 is the answer. This was simple, isn't it? Ok, let us take one more example. In this case, you need to subtract 2 from 7. So, first we will draw 7 lines. Here we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and 7 lines. As we need to subtract 2 lines, so I will cut 2 lines. 1 and 2 lines. Now, I will count rest of the lines. Here we have 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5 lines. That means 7 minus 2 is equal to 5. 5 is the answer. Ok, I hope this concept is clear to you. Let us take one more example. In this example, we need to find out number of flowers in the third box. For this, we need to count number of flowers in the first box. Then count number of flowers in the second box. After that, subtract number of flowers in the second box from number of flowers in the first box. Ok, let us see how I do it. First, I will count number of flowers in the first box. In the first box, we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 and 8 flowers. I will write it down. Now, I will count number of flowers in the second box. In this box, we have 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5 flowers. I will write it down. As we see in the earlier question, I will write a minus sign before number 5, so that anyone can understand 
that we need to subtract 5 from 8 and below 5 I will draw a horizontal line to write result of this subtraction. Ok, as you have seen in the earlier slide, I will draw 8 lines for the first number that is number 8. So, here we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 and 8 lines. And as we need to subtract 5 from this number, so I will cut 5 lines from these 8 lines. I cut 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5 lines. Now, let us count rest of the lines which I did not cut. We have 1, 2 and 3 such lines which I did not cut. So, result of this subtraction is 3. We can say that 8 minus 5 is equal to 3. So, there will be 3 flowers in the third box. I hope this is clear to you. Please practice more such examples to learn subtraction better. Thank you for watching.